or The Tiger Maximus on Facebook, or you can call 352-266-2859 for any questions. The Marion Civic Chorale announces their 2018 concert series. This exciting program highlights a special performance with chamber orchestra and video projection. The next concert will be on April 22nd at Countryside Presbyterian Church in Ocala at 7768 Southwest State Road 200. Concerts are free and begin at 3 p.m. Donations are appreciated. Contact president at marioncorral.org or visit marioncorral.org for more information. New members are welcome. Yeah, that really sounds pretty, doesn't it, Ronald? That's oh, be gorgeous. Beautiful flower right there, yeah. Yeah. Um, let's see. Uh, Galen Unold is in the meeting this morning, so he will not be calling in. I do have mm-hmm. a topic that would be appropriate for him, though. It's golf. I don't know anything about golf, but today's the opening day of the Masters. Uh, 10 something this morning. 10.42 a.m. Oh, I'm looking right at it. And uh, so uh, I do have some things you might not know about the Masters I think are interesting. But they're not all sports necessarily related. The uh, other thing I wanted to mention before we move on is that two days from today, there will be men and women with shotguns shooting clay frisbees out of the air. Yes. (laughs) All right. The clay discs are going to be launched over at the Robinson Ranch, uh, which is west of the Nellon in the town of Inglis or near the town of Inglis. Mm -hmm. Uh, Not too far from uh, Lake Rousseau, if you know where Lake Rousseau is, which is the uh, the body of water that the Withlacoochee River leads to before it then finishes up in the Gulf of Mexico. Yeah. Which is kind of cool in itself. Mm-hmm. And, there, and there are two ways that water gets out of there, I think. I think it flows through the canal and through the natural river that used to be the only way before they built that canal. Right. That partial canal. Any, anyway, so um, the reason I'm telling you about the, the gun thing, the, the shotgun thing, the shooting thing, Joe Martone from here at WOCA is going to be shooting. Robert and I will be there shooting pictures. Mm-hmm. Joe will be shooting a shotgun. Um, in addition to Joe, there will be lots of other people, and they're all there for one simple purpose. It's to help raise money for children who are special needs kids. And some of these kids, put that in quotes, might be adults in, in reality. Um, but it's, it's part of the uh, program called Champions for Champions, and uh, the reason it is called that is very cool. It's because the champions are the people who are actually participating, for example, Joe and everybody else. Mm-hmm. But they're also, for the most part, NFL alumni. They all, yeah. at one point in their lives, had played on professional NFL football teams. Mm-hmm. Now, that's pretty cool. Very cool. One of them happens to be our friend, Don Nottingham. He, be- yeah. he became a friend a few years ago when he teamed up with uh, Special Olympics, and he came into the studio with Maria Roman, mm-hmm. who's also a beautiful, marvelous lady, doing wonderful things with, with her talents and with her life, uh, helping out, again, special needs adults and, and children. Um, but they um, changed their path, their, their way of doing things, because... Hey, the money that they raise on spe- from Special Olympics events is does wonderful things. It gives money to uh, so that these kids have have a life. You know, they mm-hmm. they might not otherwise have had uh, a dance, for example, something you take for granted. You go out with your friends and you have a good time. Well, most of these kids don't have that. I mean, you may think it's a simple thing, but it's not. It's it well, and it is. I guess maybe I shouldn't say it that way, but the point is, they don't get to do it unless somebody will throw a party and, and have them show up and and they do and of course it costs money to do those things so they raise money the problem is when it was under the name special olympics and this is not to slight the organization because they do wonderful things but it's because on a local level you know we want to do more right and so when you have to send your money to the national organization whatever it is whether it's the pta or special olympics or any of them Mm -hmm. you know there there's a, a a protocol and the money, of course, has to go to some of the over, overhead stuff. Yeah. And so Don and Maria said, you know what? I, I really wish we had our own organization. So they put their heads together and they came up with the name Champions for Champions. Mm-hmm. It's really wonderful. They do the same mar- marvelous work that they've always done. Uh, and they have events to help raise money. So one of them is this coming Saturday. Mm-hmm. If you would like to be one of the people out there, men or women, doesn't matter. The only thing is you need your own shotgun they'll provide the the rounds the, what do you call yes. it the, the shells. shells okay uh, but you need your own shotgun 
I don't know anything about guns. You're going to have to go to their website to read what they have on there. And mm-hmm. I'm going to give you the website address in just a second. And it takes a little bit of navigating because they're not really good at making websites. Yeah, but they're good at raising money and they're helping really good children. at raising money. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, we would love to see you there. Robert and I will be there taking pictures. Um, everybody else will be shooting, and uh, it's, there's several different. Uh, Prizes, I guess, that will be awarded after the mm-hmm. event's over. And and, yep. by, and by the way, there's a breakfast that morning, and there's an award lunch after the whole event is over. Yeah. So it's a cost. A, it costs a hundred dollars to participate. I'll tell you this up front. Yes. Hundred dollars. You're in. Mm-hmm. You will be shooting. You just have to have your own gun. Call Don. I'm going to give you his number. Let me let me go. Through okay. The, let me go to the website. This okay. is easier to do. Yeah, and this is really nice because all of the money stays in Marion County. There's no administration fees. They're all volunteers. It's a great organization, and all the money stays in Marion County. Okay, so I'm going to give you the website, and then I'm going to give you Don Nottingham's phone number. I'm giving you the phone number of an NFL Super Bowl star. Yes. Okay? He's so got just, the t- rings just to you, prove you know, Don't share it with anybody. He's such a nice guy. All right, so this is for April 7th. So what you want to do is go to... I'm going to give you the phone number in a second, but if you want to look at it yourself, uh, nflalumni.org, nflalumni.org. Click on the events tab and then go to the April calendar, which is already here, so it's right there. Go to April 7th, and you'll see South Florida Charity Sporting Clay Shoot. Mm -hmm. Now, just ignore the word South because it's not in South Florida. It's not down in Miami. It's right here. Okay, um, and the registration at this point in time, if you had done it a month or so ago, it was $75. Now it's $100. You could possibly be on a team with one of the NFL players. They're, they're, they're going to team up with people so that you get to, to know these guys. They're celebrities, you know, and it's, it's kind of fun to hang out with uh, people who've made a name for themselves. Uh, so the entry fee includes the range targets, which are those clay things. Uh, some gifts, uh, food, uh, as I mentioned, uh, the food and beverages th- pretty much throughout the morning. Anytime you want something, just go into the little the little building there and you, you can pick something up. The Continental Breakfast is part of this. The lunch and, of course, the awards ceremony. They will provide you with 12-gauge shotgun shells. Um, if, you, if you want 20, 28, or 410 shells, you must bring your own. Uh, but they do have 12-gauge. Don't ask me. I'm not a gun guy. You must be able to provide your own gun your own protective eyewear, and your own ear protection. And a shooter must be 12 years old, and a, at least 20, 12 years old, and accompanied by a parent or guardian if they are not 18, right? That's mm-hmm. how that works. All right, now here's Don Nottingham's phone number. Keep it close to the vest. This guy is famous, okay? Yes. 352-427-0950. Mm-hmm. I'm going to tell you how he answers his phone. You ready? Hello? <laughs> Right, so don't expect like this big, uh, you know, secretary or anything like that. Don't expect a big, like, corporation answering thing. It's just done. So say, hey, is this Mr. Nottingham? Yes, it is. I heard Larry and Robin talking about the the shooting thing. Yeah, did you want to do it? Uh, yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> and then he'll tell you how to do it. All right. That's right. It's as simple as that. All right. I want to share that with you. Exactly. All right. Um, I, I spent a lot of time on that, but I think it's important. Hopefully, uh, hopefully, it's very important. Hopefully, some of you will be out there and, and you'll come and say hi to Joe and Robin and myself. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, everything you need to know about the first round of the Masters. Mm-hmm. Mm, let's see. There's some stuff on here about what they will wear. Nobody cares about that. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Are they doing knickers or are they all have long pants? See, you do care. All right. 30, 33 things you probably don't know about the Masters in Augusta. Okay. Uh, you cannot just buy tickets to the Masters. You must apply for the opportunity to purchase tickets by way of a lottery. The lottery application process for 2018. I'm sorry, 2019. Oh, wow. Begins May 10th. Mm-hmm. For next year. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Okay. Yeah. Well, there you go. Uh, many families own tournament or series badges, but they are awarded only to those on the patron list, which is full. Mm-hmm. So, <laughs> so you can't get with them. <laughs> the clubhouse was constructed in 1854 by the property owner who farmed Indigo. It is considered the first cement house constructed in the South. Well, there you go. That's kind of in, in Augusta, Georgia. Mm-hmm. After the indigo plantation was purchased, it became a fruit tree orchard 
Fruitland Nurseries is what it was called. It was owned and operated by Prosper Berkman's. Uh, there you go. So you can have some Fruitland Augusta vodka and tea as wow. a way to celebrate the masters. A lot of trees they had there then that they had to take away. In honor destroy. of the nursery heritage, each hole is named for a special tree. The first hole is named for the lovely tea olive. Magnolia is hole number five. Red bud is hole 16. Mm-hmm. There you go. This, the Masters is probably the only place in America where the line to the restroom is exponentially longer for men than for women. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> wonder if some men jump in the women's room. I don't think so. We get in trouble for that. <laughs> Almost everyone at the Masters owns a green folding chair marked with the Masters logo. You can purchase one in the gift shop for $30. Oh, there you go. It's a good price. Decent. You can find your favorite spot on the course and sit out in that special chair. You are free to roam the course with your spot marked for the rest of the day. Mm -hmm. Common courtesy dictates that you may sit in another chair. Someone might even sit in yours. But when you head back to your chair, you have dibs on that spot. If that's your chair, that's your chair. There you go. Despite the large gathering of people, the restrooms are impeccable. Each group of restrooms is outfitted with three to five people cleaning the stalls as they are used. Nice. What a job. Yeah, but I bet it pays great. You cannot buy Coca-Cola or Sprite or even Pepsi at the Masters. Name brands are a no-no. Oh. However, you are welcome to purchase cola or lemon-lime. <laughs> There's just no brand names on the sodas. Is that right? Oh, that's interesting. Wow, so it's like a, a, a naked bottle then with contents. Uh, you know about the famous pimento cheese and egg salad sandwiches, but did you know the sandwiches at the Masters are wrapped in green plastic? Why green? If anything should drop on the pristine lawn, then it will not show up on camera. Oh, there you go. That's why they have green plastic. The flags flying above the ticket gates and main scoreboard represent the players in the tournament. If you're a cigar aficionado, then you can continue the ancient golf tradition of smoking your stogie at the Masters. It's not as popular as it used to be, but they haven't outlawed it yet. No, I bet some people will light up a cigar even if you're not a cigar smoker. I uh, would. And uh, I better get out of here because we got our no non-blondes, uh, I mean... Four non-blondes. Four non-blondes um, interview. Anyway, one more. One more. Jeans are not explicitly listed as a no-no for the dress code, but it's an understood rule. You do not wear jeans. Mm -hmm. The beer list at the Masters expanded recently. In addition to the domestic and imported varieties of beer, you could also order an American craft beer. But again, no labels are in sight. There you go. No labels in sight. All right, we'll perhaps do some more of that tomorrow when Galen is on. Right now, we have to take a break. I want to make sure that you know that the only way there is a blood supply is when you and I decide to donate blood. So go to LifeSouth, donate blood, make sure somebody has a second opportunity, third opportunity, a a second chance at life, because people truly do die if they don't have blood. Mm -hmm. It hasn't happened as far as I know in recent years, but it could happen. Exactly. And the reason it doesn't is because you're out there and you're doing your due diligence. And Robin and and I try, and uh, Mm -hmm. we do it not every eight weeks, but we do our best. Okay. Right. We've got to take a break. We'll be right back. Thank you, uh, Palm Garden and Penn Flooring. We'll be right back. This is The Source, WOCA Ocala. The weather is brought to you by MyFWC.com. Safe boating is no accident on this Thursday, a nice day with intervals of clouds and sun and a high of 77 to 81. Partly cloudy Thursday night, lows ranging from 54 in the northern interior part of the zone to 60.